Hey guys, this is Randy from Cunis RV standing in front of the 2022 Jayco Jayfeather 26RL. This is the perfect half ton towable couples coach weighing in at about 6,100 pounds um, with the good equalizer or weight distribution hitch and a brake control. You can tow this pretty comfortably um, around the surrounding states and relatively flat lands with a half ton truck. If you wanna go through the mountains, a three quarter ton truck is preferred. Um, this is, like I said, the perfect couples coach. There's tons of storage inside there, theater seats that face directly towards the TV after a long day of camping, hiking, whatever. The front storage compartment is about twice the size of most campers and goes all the way through there. Detachable 30 amp serve, uh, power cord here. It's prepped for the backup camera and side cameras. Um, there's lighting in there outlets and a battery shutoff switch, but tons of stuff, uh, storage for your outside gear. In the front, you have an electric tongue jack, a fiberglass, molded fiberglass cap with the LED lights. And then towards the back here, there's two entries, one into the bedroom, and then in the back into your main living area. This thing has a huge awning. It's gotta be 20, 21 feet long. Don't know exactly, but it's big. Um, there's a entry welcome back light under the step here. The fold up um, more ride step above steps there. On the back, like I said, there's a backup camera prep so you can get the side cameras and the backup camera so you can see when you're going down the road what you're looking at there. The backup uh, reverse lights, most campers only have brake lights. This one actually has reverse lights. So people in front of you or behind you know when you're gonna back up. Um, roof ladder, which is an, uh, not an option or standard on a lot of campers. This one is standard. The back wall, talk about construction on here. This vacuum bonded laminated construction on your side walls. The back wall is also laminated and the slide out end walls are laminated. Let's take a look inside this thing here. So inside the coach, right inside the back entry door, you have uh, theater seats, which recline, outlets and USB ports on both sides with nightstands. Tons of storage there. Um, under, underneath the dinette, there's storage. This will fold into a bed. This will sleep three to four people pretty comfortably with the, the bed in the front and the dinette that folds into a bed. Here's a approximately 10 cubic foot, 12 volt fridge. Those are a lot bigger than the gas electric ones. And then next to that, you have the pantry with drawers, three drawers that pull out here and then shelves above it. If you turn back around here, plenty of counter space. This has a ton of usable features here. Um, the sink and then a lot of usable counter space here with the pop-up USB and plug-in. Um, Furion oven, microwave above your TV, which can be angled towards your dinette or towards your theater seating. Most rear living rooms have the TV way over there where you can barely see it from the, the sofa or dinette. Um, Bluetooth stereo here has outside speakers. And if you look around, there's just outlets and storage everywhere. Little storage here, upper cabinets here, which are deeper than most. The full depth cabinets here, not just six, eight inches. This is about 12, probably 13 inches deep. So you put plates and everything else up there. Then your private bedroom and bathroom up towards the front. Check out this usable bathroom. You have storage, a uh, shower, which isn't just a little tiny tub, counter space, medicine cabinet, and a foot pedal flush toilet. Then going up towards the bedroom, there's a spot on the wall here that says pre-wired for solar. You can put a solar panel on the roof and this is already pre-wired for your solar charge controller. That's to keep your battery charged. On both sides of the bed, there's wardrobes, cabinets above and a shelf above. Both sides, there's also USB ports, um, electrical outlets and light switches for above your area in the bed here. And this, just more storage. Use this as a shelf or a hanging rod up there for clothes. And then you have four drawers here. Just a beautiful layout and a great quality coach with a two year warranty front to back and a three year limited structural warranty. All right, on the outside of the coach, uh, we have, I like to point out windows when there's big windows and a lot of natural light going in. Even though these are tinted windows, it lets a lot of natural light in. Um, like I said before, the construction of this is better than every other, every other coach out there. Laminated sidewalls, 
end walls on your slide outs and the back wall. Um, here you have an outside shower, hot and cold running water if you want to wash uh, clean fish or wash off pets or clean up after the beach. Uh, your detachable power cord, city water connection, cable and satellite input, that's all in this one area here. Um, then one thing I didn't mention was the Goodyear tires. This has Goodyear tires. Most brands will use a cheap off-brand tire. Um, Again, this is Randy from Cunis RV in Green Bay. If you want to come check out a coach similar to this or this one, we have plenty with bunks, plenty with uh, rear livings, pretty much any floor plan you can think of. Hit like and subscribe to our page. Thanks for viewing.